Gladys and today we're going to assemble the epic three drawer dresser. Make sure you have all the proper pieces and hardware and if anything is missing please call consumer care. One way to know you're working with the correct hardware is to compare them with the illustrations that come in the instructions. Like that. The first step is to attach the top and bottom rails to the left side of the dresser. And for this we're going to need five 75 millimeter bolts, five barrel nuts, and two eight millimeter dowels. Also, you have to use the provided Allen wrench and a flathead screwdriver, which is not provided. First, we're going to attach the top front rail, which is the D. All the pieces are labeled and you can use the labels as guidance. Remember to insert the barrel nut sideways so the bolt can go through. You can also use your flathead screwdriver to better precision the barrel nut. Like so. Remember to always use the short set of the Allen wrench to tighten the bolt. Like that. Now we're going to attach the top back rail, which is the letter E. Now we're going to attach the bottom front rail, which is letter F. Don't forget to use the short side of the Allen wrench to tighten the bolt. Like so. Now we're going to attach the bottom back rail the letter J. First we're going to insert the dowels. And you're done with your first step. The second step is to insert the drawer rails. And remember, the rounded edge should be facing outward. Like so. The third step is to attach the right side of the dresser and for this you're going to need five 75 millimeter bolts, five barrel nuts and two 8 millimeter dowels. First we're going to insert the dowels like that. Make sure all the pieces are aligned before you continue. Always insert the barrel nut sideways so the bolt can go through. Remember to use the short side of the Allen wrench to tighten the bolt. Like that.
that's it. For the fourth step, we're going to attach the top of the dresser. And for this, we're going to need four eight millimeter dowels and 12 30 millimeter bolts. First, we're going to insert the dowels. Like so. So make sure the rounded edge is facing outward. Always use the short side of the Allen wrench to tighten all the bolts. And you're done. For the fifth step, we're going to attach the back panel. And for this, we're going to need 20 screws and they're labeled HH. For this step, we're going to use the Phillips screwdriver, which is not provided. And you're done. For the sixth step, we're going to attach the sides to the fronts of the drawers. And for this, we're going to need 12 25 millimeter screws that are labeled GG. Make sure the grooves align, like so. We're done. For the seventh step, we're going to finish assembling the drawers. For this, we're going to attach the back and bottom of the drawers. We're going to need 15 40 millimeter screws, 15 plastic barrel nuts, three 25 millimeter screws, and six 6 millimeter dowels. We're also going to need the Phillips head screwdriver, which is not included. The bottom is going to slide through the grooves. Now we're going to attach the back and make sure the groove aligns with the bottom. Now to finish attaching the support, you're going to need a plastic barrel nut and we're going to insert this sideways so the screw can go through. We're done. Lastly, we're going to attach the knobs which come with their own screw. Hold it like that. 
this. And you're done. Congratulations, you've just assembled your epic three drawer dresser.